This is Y107's Friday Phone Jacks on the Cosmo and Cat Show. Cassie just graduated from Mizzou this past year, so congrats, Cassie. Congratulations. She's like, I love your show forever and ever and ever. Uh, my brother Steven's getting ready to go to Mizzou in the fall as a freshman. Awesome. And he's fixing to live in the dorms. Even though we live in Columbia, mom and dad made us live in the dorms. I am going to play this Phone Jack prank call. I'm going to play Rick Truman. Hey. <laughs> Rick <laughs> Last so name, right? Me up. Yeah, Rick Truman. Uh, I work in housing and, and student life in the dorms, and uh, we got to get Stephen ready to find a roommate or two or three. Oh no! Hello. Yes, hi. Is uh, Stephen available? Uh, yes, uh, it is. Who's this? Hey, Stephen. Uh, it's Rick Truman with the University of Missouri uh, in the dorms, the housing department. Get your dorm assignment squared oh, away. Oh, uh, yeah, that's great. Um, I think I sent in all the paperwork you guys needed for the, the housing application, cool. right? Yeah, I got the uh, application is is right here, along with that deposit check. So thank you for that. We love the moolah. Um, I don't see <laughs> your roommate personality preference questionnaire, the RPPQ. Um, the RPPQ. I don't think I got one of those. What, mm. what is that? It's the RPPQ. Uh, we don't have any single rooms in the dorms right now, so uh, all the students have at least one roommate, sometimes more. And we try and match you with a roommate with similar personality traits so um, that you have the best chance of, you know, getting along um, and making friends. Okay. And, that sounds good. Yeah. But I don't, I don't think I saw that here in that the form in my package here. It says M-I-Z-R-P-P-Q. <laughs> uh, we can do it on the phone if you got a couple seconds. Uh, real fast. It won't take more than like, maybe 90 uh, seconds, sure. two minutes. Yeah, okay. Yeah, that'd be fine. Sweet, dude. Okay. Let's um, let's jump right in here. Uh, name, address. I'll fill those in. For, where's my pen, Stacy? Uh, all right, let's see here. Uh, your height and weight. Uh, well, I'm 5'11", and I weigh about 185. Okay, 185. Hair color and eye color, Stephen. With a V-E-N. Really? Yeah. Do you really need all that? It, it, it's part of the PPQ, uh, the RPPQ, the roommate matching uh, program here. We'll put all this information into the computer. It'll beep, 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 spit out a roommate for you, and uh, we'll get you all matched up. So okay. hair color, um, eye color. I have brown hair. Excellent. And hazel eyes. Hazel eyes. Okay, those are all of the physical questions. Now let's get into the uh, personality profile. What's your uh, what's your field of study going to be? What are you majoring in um, at the old Right zoo? now, I'm undecided. Okay. Indecisive, tentative, Stephen is hesitant. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Sure whoa. Hey, future. I'm not indecisive. I just haven't picked a major yet. Okay. It's okay. It's okay. You're wishy-washy, and we just want to pair you with somebody that's equally as wishy-washy and hasn't picked a major yet. And uh, Let's see. Question two. Uh, we have a number of international students here. Would you be comfortable rooming with a student who doesn't speak English? I suppose I'd prefer, you know, someone I could communicate with. Okay. Does not like foreign exchange students. Oh, no. Oh, hey, that's, be... that's not what I said. I, I just meant that it'd be a little bit easier, you know, to have a roommate I could, you know, would. speak the same language sure. with. Yeah, okay. Uh, would you prefer to be on an all-male floor of the dorm or a uh, co-ed floor? Um, well, yeah, I was thinking about that. Um, co-ed sounds like it'd be fun, but sure. probably get more work done on an all-male floor. Okay, right. Let's see here. Prefers all dudes, all guys. Wants to be on an all-guy well, floor. Hold on, hold on. I mean, like I like men. women. I just... I just figured I needed to buckle down and, and study and all. You, that's you know, great. Not yeah. any distractions. Definitely. And, uh, yeah, those girls can be distracting. That's for sure. I'm not judging any of your preferences and partners or anything. I'm just that filling out the form here. So. Partners here. Uh, I'm trying to be a good student. And that you should be. How about your sleeping habits, Stephen? Light sleeper, heavy sleeper? Do you snore? Do you wear a CPAP machine? Yeah, somewhere in the middle, I guess. Okay. Pretty average. Okay. Do you, do you again, snore, sleepwalk, any of that stuff? You know, no, wander the halls. Not that I know of. Okay. Ever wet the bed, Stephen? That's uh, one of the last <laughs> questions I've got. Yeah. No, Ever wet the I bed. don't wet the bed. I mean, <laughs> why is that question even on there? If, if I said yes, would you put me with a bedwetting roommate? Well, if we found one and it matched some of the other things on the uh, RPPQ, we probably Whoa, would. So, um, you know. Why not? That's that what you can do in your lawn. weird, man. Are, are we your, almost done? We are almost done, yes. Uh, when you wake up in the morning, uh, do you like to listen to the radio? Sure, I, I guess. Okay, cool. Uh, do you prefer boring talk radio or <laughs> one that has a lot of fun and does like uh, Friday phone jacks and hook up or hang up and uh, prank calls like right now, Friday phone jacks, Cosmo and Cat Show, Y107, on a new <laughs> MIC right. young freshman named Steven. Steven, you're on the radio. <laughs> oh, my God. You're, you're, you're on, you're on Y107. Guys on the radio, aren't you? We are on the radio right now. This is Y107. You're a little slow on the uh, pickup there. 
on what was going on. Your, Who sister, put you up to this? your sister Cassie, C A S S I E, got you good on a Friday phone jacks. Welcome to Mizzou, buddy. Oh man, you guys got me good. Oh, welcome. M I Z R P P Q. This has been another famous Friday phone jacks prank call with the Cosmo and Cat Show on Y one oh seven.